Hey guys, it's Clay with Branco Machinery. Today we're going to cover how to import a PDF into your Topcon data collector. So first things first, we're going to go ahead and create a new job. We'll just confirm our units are correct and we've got our new job. Now the first thing we're going to want to do is look at our PDF and we're going to have to match a line here to scale the PDF correctly. So we're going to select this 10 foot 8 inch line. And what we're going to do is come in here to calculate, enter plan, and we're going to enter a 10 foot 8 inch line. If we zoom in, we can see that that line is going north-south, and we want it to go east-west. We'll hit this icon here, give it a plus 90, and there we have our line. We'll hit this button here to save it. Now the next step, we're going to come over to Jobs, Import. We're going to make sure we've got multiple selected. We're going to make sure that we have PDF selected. Now we're going to plug in our thumb drive into our data collector. And once we've got that in there, we're going to navigate to our thumb drive. Hit the favorites, my computer. Hit the thumb drive, and there's my PDF. It's going to import your PDF. There we are. If it gives you this message that this layer already exists, just go ahead and rename it. Say yes to all. And now we're going to transform or scale our drawing. We're going to do it by matching a line, and that's where that line that we just drew comes in. We're going to mark on our PDF where we want that line to be. So we're going to use this sketch tool, this intersection sketch tool, and select the two endpoints of the line we're using. Once we've got that red line selected, green check, we can see that on the PDF the dimensions of that line is a foot and four inches and we know it needs to be ten foot eight inches. So that's why we're going to come here and match these two points. And The data collector is going to scale that. You can see our scale factor here. Save it, go home into our plan section, and we've got it in there and we've got it scaled. Now a quick and easy check is to use these sketch tools up here, click on the point, and then the intersection tool, and we can check this line right here. We'll make two quick points again. We select the sketching tool, select both points, click and hold in the white, calc the inverse, and our horizontal distance between those points is 7 foot 10 inches. And that's what our plan is saying it is. So there you have it. We've got our PDF imported and ready to use. We can set up our instrument now and get laying our project out. Um, a general application for this would be if you can't get your hands on a CAD file or if you have a CAD file that's scaled incorrectly and you're in a time crunch and need to get laying out quickly, this is a simple, easy way to start your project. If you guys have any questions, our contact information is down below. Thanks for watching.